This is Dr. Scott Gray from scottgraypt.com. In this video, we're gonna talk about assessment of the subtalar joint. And so one of the things we wanna do from a manual standpoint in assessing the subtalar joint is we wanna A, find subtalar joint neutral, but we should see a two to one ratio of inversion to eversion. So commonly, a lot of times we see clinicians say, oh, well, there's not enough pronation or supination but they, if they have a two to one ratio, we know that that's their normal. Each subtalar joint is gonna pronate or supinate or invert evert relatively different amounts based on the anatomy. But we do know is this, that they will pronate or supinate based off a two to one ratio with twice as much inversion to eversion. So take home point is this, if you assess it and you feel two times the amount of motion in the inversion rather than the pro in rather than in the inversion, then you know that foot is functioning optimally. Conversely, if you're assessing this foot and you find that it's a one-to-one -one ratio, then you know it's usually, usually lacking either supination uh, or something along the lines like that. So the first thing I want to do is really find subtalar joint neutral. And I'm at a hard angle here really to help discern that just because I'm for uh, camera purposes, but Basically what you want to do is kind of take the mid-tarsal joint, and there's a lot of different ways, and you can dorsiflex it, and then you just want to kind of roll into inversion and eversion to where you feel that talus is congruent. And there's a lot of more reliable methods out there, but this is just one that I use quickly. From here, then I want to take that calcaneus, and I want to kind of go through a lateral arc glide. So I'm kind of getting that eversion, and then I can go in here and get that inversion. Of the heel and I want to make sure I'm really stabilizing that talus because otherwise I'm not going to get that, that motion assessed properly and again I feel a two to one ratio so in this case this foot is a normal and functioning foot. 